Hey guys, so sorry about my hair and everything, but I'm doing a series, um, I'm not gonna, like, continue the series in a row, but it's gonna be called, like, I don't really know, this might be called the review a thon or something like that. I don't know, I don't even think I'm gonna call it a series, but I'm gonna review a bunch of different things. The first two things are gonna be the Realness of Concealness palette, because I just got these in the Carabaya Glam, I don't know, but since I'm kind of in a rush today, I'm gonna... Maybe the Realness of Concealness palette because it's shorter and less product. So this is $15 from Benefit Cosmetics. And this is like the perfect little kit to just pop in your purse or in your vanity. And it's like, it's not that much. So it just, when you write, when you open it up, it has a mirror. Yeah, I film with an iPod and I film right there. Yeah, I film with an iPod. I just got like a... Um, otter box. It's not a real otter box, but this otter box type thing. And it bends back so that YouTubers like me can bend them back and show them to you guys, I guess. And then it has this little pamphlet that shows you everything inside of it and stuff. What it's used for. Because some people that are just starting out with makeup or high end might not know what high beam is. I mean, come on. Or ooh la lift. I mean, come on. So, yeah. What's in here is a little three samples, Ula Lift, Lip Plump, and High Beam. Also, I think these are like half sizes or quarter sizes of the Lemonade and Boing Concealer. So, the first thing is you just hold this ribbon and it pops up. So, the first thing is Ula Lift and it is just this pink little tube or white, whitish pink. I think it's more white. And it's just a sponge tipped applicator and what I like to do is I just like to put this right here in my inner corner right there and then blend it out because it's supposed to make like your eyes look more like kind of brighten it up a little bit under there and make it look so much more like it's supposed to de-puff I don't think it does that but see it's called the under eye de-puff you can't see that it's made in London, so yeah, it's just a little tube, and it actually works really good because my under eyes are less like tender or something. I haven't used this yet. I think I have. This is a lip plump. It's called lip plump. It's a lip primer, and if you like, take this, take the applicator, and like, I don't know, lips. No, that's not gonna work. Cause look, and it'll look like you just put concealer all over your lips. So look at this. This is what it looks like. And you just blend it out. And it's just like a concealer. But it primes your lips. I thought it was like a lip plump. But it's not. And then high beam. Pretty much all you know what that is. It's just a highlighter. I have this tube of it. You know the regular tube. This is in a little cute. Sponge tip form. So. So I will just dot that on my cheekbones, on the bridge of my nose, keep it spot on the forehead. And this is what it looks like. It's a pinky toned highlighter. Which looks like that. It's actually really natural and gives you a really happy glow. And it looks just so pretty on the face. Like I wore it one day and like actually out somewhere I wore it to like because we were going to somewhere and like everybody was doing each other's makeup. And I did like high beam. And when I looked in the mirror, I was like crazy because it looks so pretty. Okay, so lemonade and then boing. So boing is just a heavy coverage concealer. I usually like to use a brush with it. Like, let me put something on. Let me put like a red, some little lip liner on the. So I just put a little bit of lip liner right there and just let me, you saw how much I rounded it over there. Do you see it? It's gone. It's like, just, you can't even see it. You can't even tell it was there. And it's so thick and just really nice. And then lemonade is kind of tricky because some people use it as an under eye concealer. Like under your eyes. And others use it what it's supposed to be for, an eye corrector. So let's pretend less like you have redness or veining or 
just something like that on your eyes. I have a little bit of veins. But I put it on the side you can't tell. So yeah, this is again what the kit looks like. It just has a little ribbon that you just ready. Just pull it out. Well, obviously, because I'm holding it like that. But yeah, it just pops out like that. I don't think it's really supposed to like pop out like that. But I will definitely be uploading this video. And if you're watching this around 9.30, 9 to 9, 10 o'clock, I am in the shower. So, yeah, that was really random. But, um, yeah, the next thing I'll be reviewing looks like this. So, yeah, um, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys when I do something else in my next video. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.